Ju, what up, what up? This is your boy King Series straight from Busy Home Beat. Yes, and in today's video, um, I've made Afro Beat here and I'm just going to break it down for you guys. This is episode two. Um, we've started this series and let's see where we, we just get to. So without wasting my time, I will just break down the beats for you guys. Then um after that, um we just listen to the whole vibe. So let's just get into the video. Trust me, your time will never be wasted. So subscribe to support your boy, like and also comment to this video. So it is a fast tempo afro beat. There's not a banner boy type of afro beat or risk it or buju fk um, benzin so this fast tempo like zlatan and um yes zlatan and maybe naira mali type of afrobeat so this is the first melody that i started with so it goes like this So for this melody, I put uh, I put EQ to cut the low ends and also put a reverb on it and um, adjust the size and the low cut of it. Yes, so that's what I did on this melody. And the next thing I did is this um, sound, this melody here. It goes like this. And for this one too, I did not put anything on it. I just adjust the volume and make sure I level it up because it wasn't actually disturbing any um, frequencies over there for me. So I left it like that. And the next melody is this guy over here. Okay, not this. Um, what is it? Okay, this. It's just a hit. This is a hit. something like that when and for that one too i did adjust the volume i didn't put anything on it like that yes so after the melody then we just i moved on with the um, the drum session so i started with this guy You know, I always tell you that whenever it comes to mixing, you can see most of the times me, my drums, I don't even put anything on it. I make sure I select the right sound for myself. You get it? I don't actually put anything on my drums. You can actually tell. So after this, then the next thing is this guy. Yeah, this percussion over here. It's very dry. So after this guy and the next thing I did um is um this champion man over here. Okay, so after this senior man I added this um fresh guy over here. You got it? And on this too, I didn't actually add anything. I just make sure I gain stage it. I level it up together with the rest. You get it? Yes. So that I could get a correct sound over there. And the next thing is this guy over here. It comes just one one. So if you look on the mixer track too. Yeah, just a simple thing over there. So after this guy, and I added this man, just comes once. Yes. Yeah, and after this, I just move straight to the kick. Yes, 
just straightforward bounce kick. I didn't do anything on it. The way it sounds, I like it that way. Yes. So after the kick, then our bass. And this is how the bass also goes. But for the bass, I put EQ on it and um, I cut the lows and the highs because the bass is actually playing in a way like it's a lead or something like that, yes. Um, yes, so I cut the lows and the highs to make sure the kick is actually banging for us. You get it? Yeah. So I added this um, vocal here and I make sure it is in key. <laughs> I added a reverb to it. Yes. A reverb to these vocals. <laughs> That's what I added to and make sure it is in key. And I added this guy to vocals. <laughs> For that one too, a reverb, yes, and um, a delay, so it makes it sound like this. Nice one. Then I just created a normal row using the playlist over here. I didn't go to the channel rack. This guy, it's still the same thing. Then this, the same thing. So that's all for the beat breakdown. Let's listen to the final beat and um, you just give your judgment at the comment section that if the beat sounds good and okay, just comment down there. If you like the beat, comment down there and I'll get um, to it. So that was still my time. Subscribe to support your boy. Like and also comment to this video. Um, and I'm out. <laughs>